Good day and thank you for watching EasyIT123. Today I'm going to show you guys how to preset a wireless connection for a specific organizational unit within Google Admin. So we'll get started all the way at the top. What we'll do is we'll open up the menu bar. Very important, you want to go to devices and then networks. Once inside networks, today we'll be dealing specifically with wireless or Wi-Fi. So we'll jump in right here, give that a second to load up, and by default, if you've never set this up before, this is the page you'll be greeted by. So specifically, I would like to target these settings at the students group. So we'll go to students, let that load up, and then add Wi-Fi. Now over here, you'll fill in your Wi-Fi name, network, and password. So what I'll do is, I know for a fact that my student Wi-Fi is called student Wi-Fi and the SSID for that is students. Remember that you need to cross match exactly what settings that you have on your side to this, otherwise the implementation won't work. So we want them to automatically connect to this Wi-Fi if they logged in on an EasyIT123 domain account. All right. Security type, obviously we want to use WPA2, that is the most strict type of security and generally the best type to use for smaller implementations. So I know the password for that, so I'm going to add that in now. We'll use the default password, 12345678.9. Remember, this is where you're going to force it. So if you want to force it to specifically only target mobile devices logged in on the domains account, you can do that. Um, in this implementation, I'd like to target our Chromebooks as well. Alright, so if you want to do that, you go ahead and you just pre-select Chromebooks. I don't have any Chromebooks currently assigned to this domain, but if you do, it will allow you to check that. And then you, you can physically target by the user login within that OU, or you can target by the device. For this example, I just want the users to be targeted, so we'll be using users. We'll go ahead and just hit add, and there we go, locally applied setting which will be setting to the students specifically within that OU of the sixth grade. The SSID will be students. It's applied to all the users that log in on that domain. SSID is obviously not hidden. Um, the auto connect has been enabled. So the second a student logs in on a Chromebook or a mobile device, in this example, we mobile device, but if you take the Chromebook, you would also get the Chromebook auto connect. It would automatically connect and be forced onto that. Uh, for the next episode, I'll be looking at how to push out settings and whitelisting, blacklisting on specific networks and OUs. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like, comment and subscribe. And please, in, in the comments, let me know what you guys want to see. I'm still new to this entire thing, but I'm really enjoying it. So thank you. Have a lovely day. Cheers. Goodbye.